it's Rosie here from Head Start and today I am really excited because I get to open up a whole bunch more of these awesome hairdo's pastels. I have four more to open. In my last video I was so lucky because I got to open these four lovely pretty pastel do's. They look so neat. I was so happy with opening them. I managed to get candy Crystal, Pixie, and Sky. So I got four different girls, and hopefully this time I get to find a whole bunch more awesome girls. I'm so excited to open these hairdos and see who's inside. On the bottle we have the awesome Lily. She has six colors in her hair. One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, she has five. Five different colors in her hair. She is so colorful. She's got bright green eyes and it says on here that we have 12 hairdos to collect. I've already found four and I'm so looking forward to finding another eight. And this is a spin to reveal bottle, it says it right here. So you spin these bottles and reveal who's inside. There is a fruity scent for each of the dolls. The contents say that we get one hairdo, one bottle capsule, one styling chair, one suction cup, one hairdresser's cape, and one collector's guide. I was so excited to see that we get a little accessory with these hairdos. It actually, it doesn't say on here that we get a styling product, do we? No, it doesn't. So this is like a super awesome bonus to get this. I was not expecting it in my first Unboxing, is that gonna come into focus for me please? Thank you. Yeah, so this was a really cool bonus to see this and they really do work very well in the doll's hair. So I was super pleased to see that. And so yeah, let's open this up and see who we've got inside. Oh and by the way guys, find the rare glow in the dark hair. How exciting is that? I didn't get to find her before, but maybe I will this time round. Super excited to take off this wrapping. The Hairdo's bottle. It has got a Reese's logo on the front of the Hairdo's logo, and then on the back it has the same. I love this color, it looks awesome. The first step is spin to reveal, so let's do that. Oh, and a new accessory. Oh, this is so exciting. So also we have on the bottom a collector's guide. So you guys can just peel that off, peel the tape off either side and reveal your collector's guide. I actually already have a collector's guide from my last unboxing, which I'm using. So this here has all of the girls that we can collect on the front. And then on the back of the collector's guide, there is all the instructions of all the steps that we need to do to get the doll out, and also some of the play. So here it says, oh, oops, 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 we don't wanna see that yet. So here it has the switch your do, and it has information of how you can switch your do. I will show you guys that later, but just so you know that's there and you can use your do on different shiny surfaces, a sticker to different shiny surfaces. So that's a really neat feature that I do love. Okay guys, here we have this new hairdo's doll. So her hairdo, her hairdo protector, the hair dryer has fallen off. So I'm just holding it in place. And that normally has the suction cup holding inside. Let me remove the suction cup and let's reveal this hairdo's do. Oh, I see a lot of purple and a touch of teal. Wow, how pretty is that? Let's have a look at the bottle. I never get sick of looking at this bottle. It is so pretty on the outside and on the back. And on the inside, we have a little salon set up which I think is really neat because you can use this for play 
and you can even stick your own shiny mirror in there if you wanted to. So it's like a little desk with lots of accessories on top. It's even got the hairdo's bottle on the top of the desk there. It's like a real salon. So you can line these bottles all up next to each other and make like a full on salon play set, which is really nice. I'll put that back there for now. So here's our doll. She has got curly hair. So flowy and wavy and curly at the same time. Now, if we look at the collector's guide, sparkle. So this is her vintage curly do. It sure is vintage and curly. Now let's remove her cape and see what pose she's in and what outfit she's wearing. She is doing the rock on symbol and she is wearing purple little boots. She looks so nice. Her colors are so matchy matchy. I really like that. Let's remove this plastic so that I can see her a little bit better. I got her out of her little plastic wrap and I am really excited about this. This whole set is looking so colorful, so pastel. She looks amazing. There is so much color going on with this girl. She's got purple hair, my favorite color. She's got a teal streak through her hair. She has got orange eyes, a pastel orange in her eyes. Sparkle, you look so sparkly. She is such a rocker. She's got a star on her forehead, a star on her cheek, stars in her pupils. She's got a soft pink on her lips and she's got a soft purple or pastel eyebrows. She's also got matching shoes and a matching pastel purple jacket or blazer on. She has got a teal dress, I think she's wearing, and she's sitting on a awesome orange, kind of tangerine colored pastel orange chair, which is really neat. Now, don't forget that we have the flip and stick feature of these pastel do's or hair do's in general, so we can flip this. Whoops. If you just, if you turn this over, you can actually see where the little bits are. So you just line them up and then you can pull the chair out. So this chair can also go onto the suction cup. So this is a feature with all the hair do's. So we have a suction cup which is great because that means we can suction her to lots of different shiny surfaces. I always show the example of the bottles. So then, well, oh, that's really stuck. Uh, oh, there's this little bit here, which helps us to pull it back up again. Here we go. All right, we can put her on her chair either way around so she can go that way so that she can be suctioned onto different shiny surfaces and face out like that or she can also be vertical and she can sit this way on the shiny surface. Super neat feature, I love showing that off, I think it looks awesome, I think it's a great feature and then if you don't want to use the suction cup you can always, oh she can't even come off the paper, it's not even that shiny. Okay let's put her onto her just normal chair base so that she can sit with the other girls. There we go, she looks great. Now her hair is super flowy and curly. It's the vintage curly do. And it looks so nice. This is the nicest color. So soft as well. Let's put her with the other girls and open up another doll. Oh look, so we have, we have five different girls now. And, oh, ah, oh, I forgot this. So we got an accessory, a bonus accessory. This looks like a cloud with a bunch of little hearts on the cloud and a tiny, tiny little lollipop with a swirl on it and a bow. That's so cool. This is a really neat accessory. It's much bigger than the other ones. It's got longer teeth, which is good for her long, buffy hair. So I don't want to comb her hair too much because I don't want to comb out her, her do, which looks great already. But if her hair gets a little bit messed up, then we can always use her comb accessory. 
I love it. Yay, let's open up the next hairdos. Here we go, here's another bottle. Will we find the rare glow in the dark hair? There's so many cool things in here. So excited, let's peel this off. Nice and easy packaging to remove. Get the tear strip. Packaging off, here's the bottle. Who will we find inside? Who's it gonna be? Let's spin to reveal. I don't wanna get in the way, so I'm gonna go over the top here. Oh my gosh, she has pink hair. Let's take off this and reveal her do and her face. Oh, her hair looks a little bit messy. But who's that? Oh, is that Candy? I think that that might be Candy. Look guys, it's Candy with the lemon drop bow do. Oh, we have a little bit of tidying to do, but it's okay because look, we've got this comb here. Yes, I love this color. So it seems like the accessories come in two different pastel colors. We have the teal pastel green and we have the kind of tangerine pastel orange. Let's pop her out of her bottle and have a closer look. Okay, so I have removed the plastic off her and I actually removed her cape. So I revealed her outfit already. So I was a little bit too excited and I revealed it all off camera, silly me. But look at her, she looks so pretty. Her hair's not quite as messy as I thought it was. It's just because her pony was like all the way over her head like that. So we can brush her hair in a second, but let's have a look at this awesome girl. So this is Candy. She is so pretty. Okay, she is she's definitely one of my top favorites right now. She's got purple eyes. All oh, right, she's the other Candy. Oh, the Candy over here, remember this girl? So now we've got the Candy from my first Hairdo's Pastels unboxing. And we've got Candy, the new Candy. And if we look at here, the collector's guide, she is the Lemon Drop Bodu. So we have Soft Rainbow Long Do and the Lemon Drop Bodu. So we have both of the candies and they are probably my favorite so far. I really like her pink hair. I'm gonna tidy it up a little bit. So she came with this really pretty tangerine colored comb, which I've just dropped on the floor. Whoops, I'll just grab that. So here's our tangerine colored pastel orange comb. It is so, so pretty. I love the detail on this thing. It's like a soft cloud with candy and hearts on it. So it's a heart full of candy and love. And I'm gonna use that to brush her hair. Let's fix her hair up. It's a little bit messy. So let's tidy it up a little bit. So I'm gonna just use this comb. Tidy it up. Swirl it around a little bit. Tidy up all those loose bits. There we go, that's looking a lot neater. Puff it up. Really lovely pink hair. <gasps> Look at her profile view. She is so sweet. I'm gonna use the comb to neatly brush her bangs, her fringe. That looks better. Very nice, very neat and tidy now. You look great, Candy. She looks so good, I love her. Let's have a closer look. She has purple eyes with the candy in her iris, uh, no, in her pupil. She's got a candy on her cheek and a candy on her forehead. She's doing the peace symbol and she's got her legs up on the chair. She has got a pastel colored purple skirt on, little frills on the bottom of it, just like this girl. She had a pink skirt on with little frills. And she has also got a pink little singlet on. 
She's sitting on a purple chair with lots of cute little symbols on it. And she's got a bright yellow bow in her hair. She is super color coordinated. The only other thing that she could possibly wear to be even more color coordinated is maybe a yellow skirt. But I like the addition of purple because it matches with her eyes. Super, super pretty. I do like her a lot. Let's do a little twirl of her do. Curly, whirly, awesome ponytail. <gasps> Look, <gasps> there's a streak of yellow through her hair. <gasps> it's at the side as well. It's all the way through. That is so soft and nice. She looks awesome. I'm gonna put her back here so that she can watch us do all the other unboxings that I've got today. I'll put the other candy back there so she can also watch. And that's her little comb that she came with. We've got her cape that she came with and the suction cup. So many cute little accessories. Now who's, that was yours, thank you. And now, let's see who else we've got in here. I'm so excited to find the glow-in-the-dark version of this hairdo. Now let's spin to reveal who's in here. Oh, no way. I was just talking about her. It's the glow-in-the-dark one. Yes. Let's get this plastic off. Oh my gosh, this is exciting. I'm going to have to do a little glow-in-the-dark thing later on so I can see her hair glowing. Take that plastic off. Oh, she smells delicious. Oh, look at her. This is a new color. We haven't seen Lily before, I don't think. Wow. She smells so good. Let's take off her cape so that we can reveal her outfit. Oh, she's so color coordinated. She's in pink and white, just like her hair and her eyebrows and all her details. So she's pink and white and green. Ooh, and it's like a glow in the dark kind of sparkly green. I like that a lot, and apple green even. These colors are so vibrant and nice. So let's turn her around. Oh, look at these streaks of pink through the white. Oh my gosh, it matches my nails. That's so neat, I love that. She is so pretty, and her hair is ultimate soft. It's so, so soft. It's softer than the other girls. It must be the special rare glow-in-the-dark hair. Hair. <laughs> that looks really nice. I like that her, she's got like a fringe that's sort of flowing out the top of her hair. That's really nice. So let's look closely at her. Now she has a pink blazer on or a pink jacket. And she's paired that with a pair of white pants, which are sort of three quarter length, I think. And she's also wearing a white top. She's got her hand in a very fancy pose. She's sitting on a apple green chair. I love this color of green. The shade is really nice. The chair has got all these little symbols on it. She has got a lily on her forehead, on her cheek, and in her pupils. She looks gorgeous. I love her. She is going to be so fun to play with later. I can't wait to switch off the lights and see her rare glow-in-the-dark hair glowing. It looks so nice, and it's so soft. We also got a awesome brush with her. This is... We haven't got the brush in this color yet, so that's pretty cool. Now that brush has got the Hairdies logo on it and a tuffet of hair. Let's see it in action. Oh, that's pretty good. That works really well. Oh, awesome. So that's going to be great for hairstyling later on. All right. Thank you so much, Lily. You are, you are gonna have to sit with the rest of the girls. So you can see the last two unboxings that I have. Oh, is it two more? How many have I opened so far? I have got 
she was, they were all from my last one. Oh, okay, it's my last one for this episode. So I've got one more to go and then we can see her glowing. This is our last bottle that we get to open for today. I'm super excited. I get to see my last pastels hairdo for a little while and then I have four more. So I got a whole CDU, but I'm only going to be opening four per video. So make sure you have subscribed to this channel and turned on notifications so you can see when I open these hairdo's pastels. Let's see who's inside. I opened up my first crystal. Doesn't she look amazing? I accidentally didn't film the actual spin to reveal, but here she is. Oh my gosh. And now it's time to reveal her outfit and her pose. Oh, look at that. She's blowing a kiss and she's wearing a little skirt and a top and a pair of slip-on shoes. I'm gonna remove this plastic so we can have a closer look at what Crystal looks like. Here's Crystal, and I think I might have a new favorite. Even though they're all so cool, it's really hard to choose. Look at her, she has got such pretty hair. She has got a kind of apple green hair. It's a color I haven't seen in hair before, so it's really neat. She has got some streaks of purple through her buns, and they kind of disappear. Oh, mysterious. Oh, here they are. So she's got streaks of purple through one of her, one of her buns has a streak of purple and the other one has a streak of pink. This is such a neat hairdo. I really love it. So she's got her hair down and it's sort of flowing out, but then she's got these super cute buns at the top. She is blowing a kiss. She has a yellow top on and a pink skirt. She's paired that yellow top and pink skirt combo with a pair of yellow slip-ons, which look really nice and comfortable. She has got teal green eyes. She's sitting on a teal green, kind of pastel teal green chair. And she's got pink eyebrows with a pink, cute little sparkly diamond on her face that's also on her cheek. And it's also in her pupils. That's so cool. I'm gonna put her down and I'm gonna look at her on the collector's guide. So here she is. And she's called, oh, Mint. Mint is a great way to describe it. So Mint Space Bundu. Oh, that's really cute. And she looks so neat in her illustration. She looks so similar to her illustration, but I think I really love the doll more, which is super exciting. I love it when the illustration is so similar, but then the doll is even like cooler, which is so, so neat. So there's her cape, it matches her really well. And what accessory do we get? Oh, yes. So we got a curler, which is perfect because we can keep her curls all nice and curly. Now, I don't know if you guys have seen this before, but these curlers, you can actually use them. So you can wrap the hair, a strand of hair, around hair curler. So this is what I do. So you just wrap it around, nice and tight there. And then you hold it for a little while. You can also spray water on this and then dry it. So it kind of dries in that shape because it, unlike a real hair curler which heats up, we don't have that. So a little trick is that you can wet the hair while it's on the curler, or you can wet it first and then curl it around the curler, and then you can hit it with a hair dryer, or just hold it for a little while, and it should keep the shape. So now when I pull that off, we have a little curl. Oh, so cute. I love it when the little accessories actually work. And this is super pretty. I love this color. The little handle that opens and closes. Awesome. So let's put her back here. And now I think it's time for us to see this girl 
in glow in the dark mode. Should we do it? I'm so excited. Let's do it. Oh, her hair. Look at it. It's glowing. It looks so cool. Oh, even like the pink and stuff kind of glows. Oh, it just looks so neat. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, glow in the dark hair. I'm so happy that I found this, this is so cool. So I had to charge her up a little bit, so I held her under the light. So in the instructions it said that you need to hold her under a light, I think it was. So the glow in the dark hair glows in the darkness a bit more. So you can try charging your hair with a torch and going into a dark room to see the color change. Okay, let's turn the light back on so that we can have a look at all the dolls together. So there you have it. We found the glow in the dark hair and it looks so, so awesome when I turn the light off. I'm so pleased that I managed to find this. She's so pretty. And even with the lights on, this color is so nice and I love the pink streaks. She looks awesome and she's totally color coordinated too. Let's put her with the rest of the girls on the chair. Here's her chair. Thank you so much for showing us your glow in the dark hair, little Lily. It was so cool. And I'm gonna put her back here. And wow, look at them all. I have unboxed so many of these awesome girls. I've still got four more to go, but I have to wait and do them in another video. So I do hope that you guys will join me for that video as well. I can't wait to unbox these last four pastels hairdos. I am loving them so far. They are so, so neat. Thank you so much for joining me today while I unbox these awesome hairdos pastels. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so that you can see the next four of these awesome hairdos pastels. Thank you guys so much for joining me today and I'll see you next time. Peace.